We've created the D15 back pocket and D16 front pocket wallet, making it out of carbon fiber and aluminum, which is literally what aircraft are made out of. Our goal is to make it both stylish and light on the pocket. While developing the carbon fiber wallet, the D15 and D16, there were a lot of things that we had to take into consideration. We experimented with multiple types of carbon fibers, different carbon fiber weaves, different thickness carbon fibers, and we experimented with different fiber orientations, trying to get the highest strength to weight ratio. Carbon fiber is not only just light, but it has like an engineered beauty about it. It's woven, it's machined, it's cut, and it's put into place. There's nothing else like that. You're able to get gloss-like surfaces on both sides of the carbon fiber laminate. It took a long time to develop and the surface finish is outstanding. The D15 is my personal favorite. It effectively separates all my cards and can keep more cards than a regular money clip. Our ability to use the wallet insert and then wrap the cash around it maximized the amount of space we had to use for the wallet itself and have the properties and strength of carbon fiber and still be able to use it in my back pocket. The D16 was literally a wallet that had never been made before. We were taking the concepts of the carbon fiber money clip and combining that to be a regular solid square wallet. We wanted to make a wallet as lightweight as possible. With that, we had to come up with what we like to call the speed bump design to hold the cards in, which is a compound angle going through the wallet. Our goal with that was to make a wallet that could slide in and slide out with ease and be just as big as your phone. We wanted to bring different colors to people in order to make their wallet. By anodizing the aluminum, we're able to create aluminum parts in almost any color you'd want. We've been prototyping wallets like crazy, trying to get the fit down for the D16 and D15. We were trying to get the angles, trying to get the size right, because we were looking to make a wallet unlike any other that had been made previously. 